Welcome to the 19th IISS Shangri-La Dialogue. We will continue to promote economic cooperation based on the idea of human security, respecting the ownership of each country and the interests of its nationals. To achieve prosperity in these difficult times, ASEAN and the Indo-Pacific region must remain the growth engine of the world. No region will do more to set the trajectory of the 21st century than this one. And so the Indo-Pacific is our center of strategic gravity. China-U.S. cooperation is vital for global peace and development. Confrontation will benefit neither our two countries nor other countries. China opposes using competition to define the bilateral relations. It will be historic and strategic mistake to insist on taking China as a threat and adversary or even an enemy. It is on the battlefield in Ukraine that the future rules of this world is being decided along with the boundaries of the possible. So let us save the whole world from coming back to the times when everything was decided based on the so-called right of might and when certain peoples and their ideas and many nations were of no consequence. There is no far away. A war in one part of the world affects people across the globe. The war in Ukraine has already affected all of us, also people far beyond the European continent. In Fiji, we are not threatened by geopolitical competition. In our Blue Pacific continent, machine guns, fighter jets, grey ships and green battalions are not our primary security concern. The single greatest threat to our very existence is climate change. It is not an exaggeration that we now stand at a potentially dangerous point in our history. The receding tide of global cooperation and goodwill have shown up naked ambition and vulnerabilities. How do we change trajectories and avert disasters?